Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the offices of Hold My Nuggets Incorporated. I am your founder and your CEO, the diligent, vigilant, meticulous, sagacious, conscientious, analytical, methodical individual, the Chiseled Adonis. Now, if you're here for the free coitus sex doll giveaway or the free hats, you are in the wrong place. Feel free to go to the Shadow Realm. Oprah Winfrey is hosting that giveaway. For those who do remain, you're asking yourself two questions. Why am I here? Were there really quaaludes in the water at the front desk? I cannot confirm nor deny the validity of said sentiments in the second question. However, I can only plead the fifth. As for the first question, we are here because I have woken up this morning with a copyright strike on my YouTube channel. When I went to the gym, I was clanging and banging. The Demanding my muscles to grow and I received a DM message. No, not from Janelle Monet. No, not from Scarlett Johansson No, not from Ariana Grande. No, not from Miss Haiti or Miss Jamaica. No, not from Marigat Robbie I got it from one of my Lord followers telling me that I had my video removed and there's a copyright strike When I went home and I looked on my YouTube channel, this is exactly what it is that I saw Now this strike me as odd because from the beginning of the season, myself and the NFL has had quite the relationship via email where they would email me letting me know, hey, we are claiming copyright on your video, however, we'll allow your video to exist and we will be claiming all dollars from advertisements, as you can see from week one to the Pro Bowl. Fascinating, isn't it? What made this week so different? Was it because it was the Super Bowl, the granddaddy of them all, as you would say? No, that wasn't the case because the NFL, the entity that is the NFL, I should say, did not email me for copyright. Oh no, it was a specific claim that came in. In fact, there was a time frame, as you can see here. Would you look at that? It's a humanoid of the female persuasion. Now, I would pronounce your entire name, Nancy, but I don't know how to pronounce your last name. Is it what, what, get, what, what, it doesn't matter what you, I would finish it, but I don't want to be striked for copyright yet again. Vince McMahon, I'm looking at you. But you did provide a time frame. So let's take a look at said time frame in the video to see exactly what it is that I may have said or put in the video that could have led to me being copyright striked upon my channel. Jaskowski to kick another 26 yard field goal, but the holder pulls a Tony Romo. He couldn't get the snap. It's off the left crossbar. No good. What'd you eat before the game? Was it butterfingers? You goddamn bum. No good. Gosh golly, I'm struggling to figure out why joking about a kicker would lead to a copyright strike on my channel. It wasn't any extraordinary clips that was thrown in there. In fact, there was no outside clips from outside of the NFL. So what was it about that said clip that led to you claiming copyright? on my channel leading to my video being removed and also me getting a strike on my channel could it have been a specific joke maybe it was tony romo let's listen to it again Skowski to kick another 26 yard field goal but the holder pulls a tony romo he couldn't get the snap it's off the left crossbar no good what'd you eat before the game was it butterfingers you goddamn bum no good now this led to me investigating exactly who is this nancy so let's go to linkedin and find out exactly who this person is By heavens, she is employed by the NFL. Well, Miss Nancy employed by the NFL, could you answer me one question? Why is it that I did not have any of my football videos removed on YouTube from week one of the NFL to the Pro Bowl last week? But this said 10 second bracket in the Super Bowl video led to me getting a copyright strike. So I did further investigating and I was able to find said lady's Facebook page. And this is what I came across. Let's take a look at her profile where she's a proud to be an American, where at least she knows she's free. Whoa, wait a minute. Well, that's odd, Nancy. There you are photoed with Tony Romo, and it seemed the 10 second bracket where I got the copyrights right also involved a Romo joke. So if I was to, no, Nancy, are you a Tony Romo fan? No, Nancy! Are you a Cowboys fan? Did you feel personally offended by the joke? Are you sponsored by Diamond Crystal Salt? What is going on, Nancy? Please let me know why it is that you filed for a copyright strike against my channel, but you happen to be a Cowboys fan, and the joke happened to be about the Cowboys during that said 10 second bracket. Let's do a little bit more investigating, Nancy. Well, don't you think I should do that, Nancy? 
Niblet's Pythagorean Theorem. Nancy, you are indeed a Cowboys fan. However, given your job description, your job is to look into videos that do violate copyright and violate the brand that is the NFL and then flag those down. But why is it that you waited until the Super Bowl in a 10 second time bracket where a Tony Romo joke was made to get my video removed? Is it that I violated the copyright of the NFL or you felt offended that your favorite team was joked upon? Isn't that the case, Nancy? This had nothing to do with violating the copyright of the NFL. This had everything to do with you watching my video beginning to suffer from anal fissures because your butt hurt that Tony Romo, your god and savior, was violated verbally by the Chiseled Adonis. Ain't that right, Nancy? Nancy! Nancy, tell me why you flagged my video, Nancy. So you mean to tell me the 80 plus videos that had the NFL's content dating back to December of 2016, none of those were flagged down. However, this game in particular, in a 10 second bracket, that had your favorite player from Dallas incorporated inside the joke. That is what gets flagged down. This has nothing to do with the NFL. Doesn't it have everything to do with your personal feelings? Ain't that right, Nancy? Nancy, tell the people the truth. Why'd you flag my videos down, Nancy? Cause I'm a butthurt cowboy fan. You hurt my feelings when you made fun of that boys. So upon my investigation, I've decided to slide into the DMs of said Nancy and ask her why it is that she decided to flag my videos. Nancy, allow me to formally introduce myself. I am the Chiseled Adonis. Evidently, it is you who filed a copyright claim on my Super Bowl commentary video and ultimately got the video removed. So I am messaging you to ask you one question. Why did you do it, Nancy? Oh, oh, I'm just looking at the clock because it's been nearly five hours and I'm yet to get a goddamn response from Nancy. Nancy! Nancy, tell the people the truth why you flagged down my videos. You've been diagnosed with hemorrhoids because you're a little bit butt hurt after all the Dallas Cowboy jokes throughout the season. Ain't that right, Nancy? So let me get this straight. Throughout the entire duration of the NFL season, I've made fun of all 32 teams. I've made fun of darn near every sport. I've made fun of every single player. I've made fun of every single race. I've made fun of every single country. I've made fun of every single city. I've made fun of every single war. I've made fun of every single president, financial, anything, dealing with comedy, I have made every single joke. But you, working for the NFL, you found everything okay, we'll just let it go on scot-free. But then when the Super Bowl comes along, you decide to be scandalous. Why are you so scandalous? In a 10 second bracket, because Tony Romo happened to be your favorite quarterback, you decide to flag my video down and give me a copyright strike. Nancy! Nancy, tell the people the truth. Why did you flag my video, Nancy? Cause we were supposed to be them boys. We were supposed to win the Super Bowl, but you kept making fun of us. Oh, I was just looking at all these egregious watches, trying to figure out how I got all this time, but I'm yet to get a response from you. Nancy, Nancy, tell the people the truth. Why'd you flag down my videos? Because I didn't like the way you made fun of Zach and Dick and Death. Gosh golly, the Articles of Confederation was a weak central government. The mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell. And it's shameful that I will not be getting a response from Nancy as to why I got a copyright strike on my channel. It's rather salubrious and auspicious that we don't reside in the same neighborhood because you're able to avoid this face-to-face -face confrontation. I'm sure it would be an arduous task to figure out where it is that you live, Nancy. But wait! It's not, because I'm from New York. Where you from, Nancy? Oh, in the bio, it says you're from Westbury, New York. Wait a minute, I'm from the city in New York. Oh, that's about an hour and 10 minute drive away. Here I go. Gotcha, bitch. Great Scott, son of Odin, child of Arceus, I've got myself a blues clue. Why don't I get into my car, turn the ignition, hit the reverse, hit the drive, pull out of my driving space, drive on the highway, tow all the way to Westbury, New York, so we can have ourselves a conversation over brunch. You like pancakes, Nancy? I love pancakes, Nancy. We can have ourselves a wonderful brunch, and we can conversate over why I got a copyright strike on my YouTube channel. You think that'd be great, Nancy? I think it would be phenomenal, Nancy. No, I'm not looking for any sort of conflict here. I'm not trying to be the aggressor, Nancy. Listen, I'm not gonna pull up with any of my degrees. I'm gonna leave my PhD in Chris Brown and Bobby Brown studies from Ike Turner University at the house. We're not gonna be going up any elevators, so I don't need to make sure I've come with my, novelty, with my novelty Ray Wright shirt. No, you don't gotta worry about that. My right arm, I'll cut it off. You don't need to know I studied under the teachings of Sean Penn and Sean Connery. We don't need to worry about that at all. I just wanna have a conversation about why my video
videos got removed. All right, that's not a threat. It's a guarantee. It's not a prediction. It's a spoiler. I'm not just sure. I'm HIV positive that the people who are gonna hepatitis C. Why my videos got removed? Nancy, Nancy, tell the people the truth. Why'd you remove my videos on YouTube? Okay, okay, I'll admit it. I'm one of the dumb cowboy fans that you talk about on your videos. You kept making fun of them boys, saying the boys wasn't gonna win the Super Bowl. But I believe in my heart they was gonna win the Super Bowl. When I saw they didn't win the Super Bowl, I couldn't bear to watch the Super Bowl with you making cowboys jokes without them in the Super Bowl. So I got on my computer and I wrote down that you copyright strike against the NFL because we them boys, we were supposed to win the Super Bowl. In closing, I'd like to thank you guys for coming to the offices of Hold My Nuggets Incorporated for this deposition. I would hope that you were able to come to a conclusion on your own to figure out whether this was fair play by the NFL or if there was a specific individual who happened to be very butthurt from anal fissures and hemorrhoids and constant penetration of analingus and said other sentiments as to why my video got removed. Now for me, I'm headed into the shadow realm and to go pick up some of that Oprah Winfrey giveaway of coitus fornication dolls and free hats. I hear through the grapevine that there's only a few left and I want to make sure I get there before they're all gone. Have yourself a good day. Oh, excuse me, Nancy, sorry. Uh, my apologies. Uh, here at Hold My Nuggets Incorporated, we like to send off our opposing prosecutors with a kind message. Hey, uh, could you come here so I can whisper in your ear? Yeah, thank you. Uh, so, um, I appreciate your, um, your claim and your work here today, but uh, before you leave, I just need you to hold my nuggets. Suck my dick! Tell them the truth. Why'd you flag down my videos? Gaskowski to kick another 26-yard field goal, but the holder pulls a Tony Romo. He couldn't get the snap. It's off the left crossbar. No good. What'd you eat before the game? Was it butterfingers? You goddamn bum. No good. What's wrong with them? What's wrong with them? What's wrong with him? Oh, what, son? What's wrong with you?